Hello dear student welcome you all on my channel in this video we are going to study how to prepare the slide for pollen germination for this experiment we required one vinca flower that is also called as a periwinkle flower it should be fully developed one second thing we required one clean slide as well as one clean cover slip we need a dropper we need one forcep pointed forcep one needle as well as we have to prepare the sugar solution we need the normal sugar what we get in the market so we'll take the half beaker of the water approximately half beaker of the water in which we'll add 1 teaspoon of the sugar which is normal sugar what we get in the market so add approximately we have to make the concentrated sugar solution for the pollen tube germination okay so stir it well so that all sugar will get dissolved and then we'll get the concentrated sugar solution so this will keep aside now i'll take the slide first on the slide we'll take the this sugar solution which is a concentrated sugar solution take one or two drop of this sugar solution on the clean slide at the center of the slide now we'll take the flower which is a fully developed flower hold it at the center take the whole of petals and just pull it away from one another and then at the center you'll find four anthers of which just take out one of the anther and just put it on the slide in the sugar solution try to open the anther so that all pollen grains will come out and now whatever the pollen grains are there which will release from the anther and we'll remove the wall of the anther now if required add one more drop of the sugar solution as well as if glycerin is required then put the cover slip carefully on the slide just touch on the one side of the sugar solution and release with the help of the needle so that there will not be any air bubble now this slide is a uh, ready what we have to do pollen grain which need the humidity for its germination so we'll take the another wash glass on which we'll keep the filter paper just drop the water on which so that we can create the humidity 90% humidity is required to get the good growth of the pollen tube now we'll keep that slide on this filter paper which is a uh, already wet now put the another wash glass on it which so that it will get the proper temperature proper humidity and this will keep aside at least for the 30 to 40 minutes after 30 to 40 minutes what we'll find the pollen grain will get germinate the pollen grain will absorb all the sugar solution as a result inside that the volume will get increase which are exerts a pressure on the intine and the intine will come out through the rupturing the germ pore and that will come out in the form of the pollen tube so this will watch under compound microscope under 10x power hold the slide properly with the help of the clip adjust the distance between the slide and the objective lens first get the rough adjustment and then you can do the with the help of the fine adjustment we can get the clear idea about the pollen grain now we'll watch through the ips what we find here number of the pollen grains are there which are in the initial stage but after few minutes means after the 30 to 40 minutes requirement for the pollen germination after 30 to 40 minutes what we'll find all the pollen grains will germinate this is about the initial stages there you can observe that all the pollen grains are there which are the 
I mean now this is about the after 30 to 40 minutes. This pollen grain we started germinated and here the number of the pollen tubes we can observe. Each pollen grain produce one pollen tube. Sometimes it produces a two three pollen tubes also. So we can get the clear idea how the pollen grains are germinating by absorbing the sugar solution. So pollen grain which has the exine and the intine when it absorbs the sugar solution through the germ pore inner volume increases as a result intine comes out from the germ pore in the form of the pollen tube. So this is the in vitro germination that is outside which is a artificially prepared sugar solution on which we have taken the pollen grains of the vinca flower. Now this is the initial stage and this is about the final stage when we get the pollen grains germinated from the pollen tube. If you like this video kindly share with your friends, subscribe and ask your friends to subscribe so that you can get the all the different type of the videos regarding the biology practicals as well as about the some theory parts. Thank you.